Knock knock is Knuckles. Hello and welcome back to Knuckles in Sonic 1. The ROM hacker where you get to play as the rougher than everyone's favorite, rougher than the rest of them in Kidna. I swear I didn't steal that from a video of OC do not steal and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Anyways, we got three of the emeralds in the last part. And uh, went through Spring Yard, gave a little bit of an introduction to myself as best as I can without... What the heck? Oh, I knew that was going to... I had a feeling that was going to screw me over, but... I should still be in good shape. I know that I usually get caught on. Anyways, we're going through Spring Yard Zone, and honestly, uh, this is probably one of my favorite zones in the game. Yeah, you get to deal with all of this fun stuff with waiting on those blocks, but aside from that, it, it's, like, the music's pretty good, it, it's it got a nice look to it, and this is, like, the precursor to, like, every game having the, uh, the stupid, like, every game having a casino after some kind of zone, like, as the third or fourth zone in the game, like, everyone having, like, a casino of some kind, so... This was before any of that, so... Yeah. I don't have a way of getting up, because Knuckles jumps... Don't go that high. Nope, I don't screw up. There we go. Now, I can just hit this one. Go through here, hit that. There we go, next special stage. Hmm. So it's weird, like, it's weird seeing this only because Knuckles is more detailed than everyone else, and everything else, and he's darker than everything else. So he kind of stands out. Like, if you notice the red on these springs... No, not that spring. No, get it away from there. Get me away from there. Get me out of there. But if you notice the red on the gold spheres and the... And the bumpers... I said spring earlier, but I meant bumpers. Oh. How do they hang on that? Huh. Interesting. Okay, there we go. Four emeralds down, two to go. But yeah, if you notice, like he's a darker red than everything else in the game. Even the even the emerald, if you can see it, which doesn't look like you can. This is a darker red than everything else, and it's just like maybe it helps a little bit because he kind of sticks out. Oh, this thing did it. This thing was definitely built for Sonic. This was not built for someone having a shorter jump. So, resorts. Well, that didn't work. And that made things worse. Wonderful. Yeah, see, I can't even get all the emer I can't get all the rings out of that. that, hit that, and then... Can I go over that? No, oh, dang it! I was planning to just completely go over that. Well, now it's time to collect as many rings as freaking possible, so that way I can at least get to the special stages even sooner. I don't want to where I'm stuck with just five and I have to go through, like, Starlight Zone, because that'd be my only chance. Now, if I remember correctly, we can drop down... Oh, well, we're going to be running springs anyways. Or bounce. The yellow ones are springs, the red ones are the are bumpers. I'm going to keep forgetting to call them the, by the right thing. That's my fault. I apologize. It, it just drops through. It won't let you uh, glide afterwards. Okay. Well, I mean, it's good to know that. Hmm. This, on the other hand, is going to be a problem. Never mind, it's manageable. Just barely. Hit 
take those. We have just enough. Maybe we can take the high ground the whole time. Realize that I'm playing as Knuckles yet. I'm taking like all of my normal routes through Sonic 1. When I know I can just take high ground, the higher routes. Can I get a 1-up after this? Or for this? Nope. 94, 95, 96. Ooh, just barely enough for a 1-up. There we go. We're going to go for our fifth one. It's going to be good. I think this is the other... Op yeah, it's the other open-ended one. No, 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 no. Sometimes when I press the, when I press a button just to jump, it it just doesn't work. Okay, we got it. We had it. Yes, thank you, and thank you. Emerald number five, done. I'm doing better than I normally do. Usually by now, okay, most times, most times I'm I'm doing better than most of the times. So there's only been one run that I've done of this where. That would have been my sixth one. But normally I make one or two mistakes, depending on... Depending on exactly which run it is. It, it varies. That's the thing with this game. It's going to vary on how well you do. Technically don't need any of this, but... Because we can do... We can do the, um... Since we do have the ability to climb, it does make it a lot easier to go through these kind of sections where you're forced to go through this. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm not really forced to go through this since I can glide and there is a, a limit to how high how high up the level can be, so... Shoot. Actually, you know what? Let's test that. Can I... No, I can't. Okay. Not with this one, which would have been very helpful, but... There we go, we'll just keep doing that. Yeah, that I, that actually hmm, wasn't that bad. Okay, I've got to stop being careless and hitting things. Normally, I would just go and get... Hmm, how high up can I go? I know I'm breaking the game and I'm not showing parts of it, but I'm curious. Can I go up here and just glide to the... Wow, this one actually has a... Crap. Alright, we're going to take the normal way through. But first, I'm going to get me some power-ups. that through. I can go up, or I can go this way. And I went the right way, because then I would have been stuck doing that stupid thing. Hmm. Just wait for these to go by, and I'll be able to fight Robotnik once again. Okay, you know what, since since I have you here and we're talking Sonic, um, I never got the whole thing with, like, at, when I was younger, I, uh, I never got the whole thing with the Eggman or Robotnik, it's like, so what's his real name then? 
because I didn't know that there was a difference between you know what they were calling them and what we were calling them so I just figured well what's his name then and the manual says Robotnik they call him egg oh my god okay let's not do that That's actually the worst I've done on this. I mean, aside from actually losing a life, but <laughs> let's not do that again. Um, but yeah, I never knew what they called him. Like, I just see the manual for Sonic Adventure, and it just says Dr. Robotnik, and apparently they call him Eggman. I was like, so he's Robotnik. Fine. And then I would see something like Sonic X. Yes, I'm aware that the 4Kids version is trash. But then they would call him Eggman, so it's like... So they changed his name. It's like, I, I didn't really have like a, oh, it's so stupid that they changed his name. It's like, oh, so that's his name now. Okay, whoa, I got pretty high up there. Now, if I remember correctly, there is a way to get through this, but I'm not sure if I get the last ring that I'm going to need because from what I found out is that there's an alternate route that you can take that would skip the majority of the level. And no, it's not the alternate routes I've been finding. Although those have been helping. This is like a legitimate alternate route that you can take in the level. That would have been a bad idea. And it's at this point. Hit these. Hit those. I need that thing gone. That's not good. Dude, I should be able to climb on that. Wait, what if I spin? Crap. I might have just screwed this up. Okay, so the idea is that I go on here. Hmm. Okay. Air bubble. And I can't glide. So I actually can't progress in this level. It's crazy to think. I mean, I can go this way, which might respawn it, so I'll, I'll do that. If it respawns it, then that will be a lifesaver, but I, I technically can't go through the level. Because I can't climb on anything as I'm swimming. Oh, dang. Wow, am I really stuck? Huh. That's a new one. Never mind. Oh, I can glide. Uh, I can climb on things, so... That's a new one. Wait, what am I doing? This is it. Hop on one of these, and then just keep going through the level this way. I think I might not have enough. That's the thing. I have 46 right there. But... I, from if I can if I remember correctly crap oh no and I don't think I jump high enough I barely jump high enough please tell me there's like some kind of invincibility please anything okay, I'm gonna have to hold left as I do this I hope I hit nothing okay hit that Hit that. Hit that. And I'm one short. Oh, that's wonderful. Shut up, game. I know what I'm doing. Yeah. The original Sonic the Hedgehog, like, if you went this route, there was no way of getting that last ring, so... Unfortunately, I don't get... I don't go to the last, uh... I don't get to go to the last eight, um, the last chaos. Em I don't get to go for the last chaos emerald. Unfortunate, but it happens. I can probably do it in Act Two, though. If I remember the layout, the only thing is that that shorter jump really just made me a little paranoid because I mean the stage is designed for Sonic, so any di any differences to his control could drastically alter 
my run of this game. Hit that guy, hit that guy. Air bubble. I'm gonna stick around this side. See? Okay, I thought I was gonna get hit. I'll take an I'll wait for another air bubble. Fine, open it then. Do not let me run into anything. Oh, I can go up this way. And then just go to these. This level gives you a lot of opportunities for uh, rings. I was going to say coins. Rings. So, out of the first two levels, I like this one a little bit more just for that. That was a trap waiting to happen. Press that button, drop down. Press that button. Hope I... No! No! You... Ugh, you suck! That basically means I have to go through Starlight Zone just to get this. I mean, it's doable, it's just, I wanted to get this as soon as I can. So he's taller? That shouldn't have happened. The top, of my, uh, top of my jump, I clipped the freaking part of the ceiling, so... Well, I guess it's beat this level as fast as I can now. Should get rings, though. I just realize I'm not doing that. There are no rings here. So that means anything will result... Anything... Everything and anything can result in a game... Not a game over, but... Damn it! Are you kidding me? That's what I get for not getting rings. There we go. We got rings, so we've guaranteed some kind of safety. I do like that it still lets you move fast enough underwater. I just don't like the fact that uh, I'm basically just rushing to get air. But I'm in a safe zone. So I'm, I'm in a safe area, so I don't have to worry about not getting air. How many points did I get for that? Okay. Well, with all that silliness done, uh, I say we end it for now. Uh, I will see you guys in the next part. If you're enjoying the, if you're enjoying the let's play, by all means, give that video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new, and uh, check out some of the other videos that I've made. Until then, I will see you guys in the next one for Labyrinth Zone Act Three.